Hello and welcome to the first tutorial in the C++ programming series and in this part we're going to be looking at what is C++. C++ is a generic purpose programming language. It has imperative, object oriented and generic programming features while also providing the facilities for low level memory manipulation. It is extremely powerful, it's widely used across the world, it's one of the most widely used languages alongside something like PHP which is the web. C++ is one of the most popular if not the most popular languages on desktop. If you know C++ you've got a good basis for learning not only other languages but just development in general. Also it's cross platform which is fantastic. It's running on Windows, Mac, Linux, Android, iOS, Windows Phone and, and there's more platforms than that as well and it's pretty much every new platform that comes out supports C++ so it's, so it's great. C++ inherits a lot of C syntax so if you know C um, if you don't, it doesn't matter, but if you do, you'll feel right at home. A lot of it is, most of it's there, or most of the syntax is, most, most of the way you do things is in C++. It's just an extension of it. It's sort of what is called C++. Plus mean increment, as in C equals C plus 1. It's the same, it's the next step of C. Object-oriented programming, or, or sometimes referred to as OOP, double O-P, the programming paradigm that represents the concept of objects that have data fields. And these are basically attributes that describe the object and associated methods, uh, which sometimes we can call as functions or procedures. Objects, which are usually instances of classes, are used to interact with one another to design applications and computer programs. Other languages are object oriented as well, such, such as Objective C, which is used for iOS and Mac. You can sort of use it for Android using a portable and other, other frameworks, but it's iOS and Mac native. Java, C Sharp, Ruby, Python, and what have you. So yeah, that's really it for this tutorial, just to go over what is C++. In the next tutorial, when I look at actually setting up a project on a Mac and on Windows, if you have any questions, so just feel free to message us at support at sonarsystem.co.uk. The email will be in the description. You can comment on this video, just directly message us via YouTube, whatever you feel comfortable with. Also, in the future tutorials, when we actually start coding, we will actually provide a link in the description to the source code as well, so you can just com compare and contrast your own code and just use the other general reference. So, just one little note, thank you for watching, and I hope you have a nice day.